How to install new line in a traditional bump head. The traditional bump head has a round black cutting head with a one and a half inch spring loaded knob in the center. That's the bump knob. Installing line in a traditional bump head requires you to disassemble the cutting head. But first, you'll need to cut about 10 feet of line to install. You can either use twin strand split line or cut two pieces of .095 inch trimmer line to 10 feet each. Now, to disassemble the cutting head, unscrew the bump knob counterclockwise and remove the inner reel and spring. Find the two holes on top of the inner reel and insert both ends of the line into one of the holes. Pull the line through until two to three inches remain. Then loop your short ends over into the other hole and pull the long ends to close the loop. Now wind the line around the reel in the direction of the arrow on top. You'll have to apply some pressure to wind it evenly. When you have about six inches left, push each string end into the holding slots marked .095 inches. Place the spring back on the shaft, then find the eyelets on the spool head and feed the strings through. When placing the reel on the shaft, align those holding slots on the reel with the eyelets on the head. Holding the reel down to compress the spring, tighten the bump knob back on. Gently pull the lines to make sure they were released from those holding slots, and you're ready to go. Thanks for watching. You can trust all Troy Built string trimmers to stand up to the task season after season. Visit TroyBuilt.com for more information. TroyBuilt. Built for life.